Let's first understand what causes cellulite. And before you go ahead and blame your genetics, let me bust that myth by looking at Olympic level track and field athletes. Are you seriously telling me that not a single person who competes in track and field is genetically geared to have cellulite? So would it make more sense that it's your lifestyle that's causing the cellulite and not your genetics? Common contributors to cellulite include sedentary lifestyle, poor diet, smoking, excessive stress, and inadequate hydration. Poor circulation impairs the delivery of nutrients and oxygen to your skin and the underlying tissues, and it leads to weakened connective tissue and reduced collagen production. This is a major contributor to cellulite. While cellulite can occur in individuals of any body weight, it is more common in individuals with high levels of body fat as this can exacerbate the appearance of cellulite. The structure and flexibility of the connective tissues beneath the skin can impact the appearance of cellulite. When a connective tissue fiber becomes stretched or weakened, and this could be due to weight gain or as part of the aging process, fat cells can push through the fibrous bands resulting in the appearance of cellulite. Finally, hormonal changes such as fluctuations in estrogen or progesterone can contribute to cellulite. Hormonal changes generally affect blood flow, collagen production, and fat storage, all of which may influence the appearance of cellulite. 